In today's video, this brand new Element Ecto is getting its first official mod. As with any crawler, tires, tires, tires. We're going to be set, putting a set of the Proline Trencher Crawler Tires 1.9s on this truck and doing a head-to-head -head comparison of the stock tires versus these. How do they do? If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Troy. This is Roadside RC. On this channel, you'll see us doing all of the crawling, bashing, drifting, racing, all that kind of stuff, plus some product review videos and how-tos. And today, that's exactly what we have. This brand new Element Ecto, been driving it around, been doing some stuff with it, been really, really enjoying it. But as with any ready-to-run crawler, one of the first things that you really question with the truck is, how good are the tires and how good would it be if I put something different on there? And so today, Proline Trenchers, you see the blue dot on here? This is actually the Predator Super Soft Compound. We're going to give that a shot. And in order to make my life a little bit easier, instead of swapping over from the factory wheels here, I'm actually going to be um, swapping over to these wheels. Give it a little bit of chrome, give it a little bit of color as I do this um, and make the back-to-back -back testing just that little bit easier so let me get to mounting these up and then we will see how the uh, then we'll start doing the head-to-head -head testing
All right, we are back from our test, back to back, running these stock tires, these uh, the general grabbers that come on the truck versus Proline Trencher crawler tires in the Predator Super Soft compound. And of course, as you may imagine, really world of difference. And I hope it comes across on the video sometimes. I always, I always try to film it in a way that you can actually see the differences. But wow, like, so yes, can, are the tires magic and they immediately make the truck go over everything? No, of course not, right? But man, it made such a difference. And some of those climbs that you could see, I got farther up that first obstacle than I've done with any vehicle so far. That was great. Um, really good um, on the, the wood up, just made it so easy. Really, all of that kind of stuff really made a difference. Now, I will say these uh, the axial gladiator wheels that I put them on were not a good choice. I didn't even pay attention ahead of time, but the offset is slightly different than on the stock wheels, pushing the whole wheel in inboard a little bit. Now, didn't really have any issue with body rub in that situation, which is awesome, but um, it did make the truck narrower, a little bit tippier, I found, and some things that, and some things that actually weren't on the video, um, I found that it was a little bit tippier that way. So definitely, I'd probably be looking at a different set of wheels in order to make sure I'm kicking them out just slightly to help the side hill and stability that way. But overall, are these tires an improvement? Yes, 100%. Yes, these are definitely an improvement over the stock tires, and of course, they look pretty dang good on the truck too, right? I do love the uh, that trencher crawler pattern that Proline put out. It really is quite nice. We've been using it on my father's Gen 8. They've been great. So I am confident with their performance here on this truck. So I'm not done with this thing yet. There's still some more stuff that I wanna do to this Element Ecto. I'm going to get working on that. In the meantime, please come over here, check out some other videos that we've already produced. I really appreciate it. Every bit of the support that you give the channel, I really, truly do appreciate every bit of it. So thank you, and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.